I mean, if you are someone who is really grounded in in nature, the natural world, you understand that rivers need to move. That that rivers they can't even beat at the same place on the landscape without destroying it. And then when they're when they're really flexible, you've got this ability to distribute the impact of flow over a much broader area. And I our cardiovascular systems are very much the same. I always think of when I stand at rivers, I can see what I'm like, oh look, there's a corollary flow. You know, I I really see river science and cardiovascular science in the same lens because I think the mechanics are the same. You're you need to open up the the rivers of your of your uh hip joints and you need to open up the rivers at your knee joints and you need to open up the rivers at your shoulder joints and they need to uh have the the banks the shape of the river change regularly so that you're not creating do we call it a callus we call it a wound yeah trauma on the inside at these same you're not getting repetitive injuries within the blood vessels themselves